The headlines this are at least 20 people have been killed in Indonesia after a tsunami hit beaches around the Sunda Strait between the islands of Java and Sumatra. A statement released by the country's Disaster Mitigation Agency says another 165 other people had been injured. We are still waiting for details, but it appears to have been caused by an eruption at Mount Anak Krakatau, which occurred last night at around 9 p.m. local time. The U.S. government will partially shut down through Christmas after lawmakers failed to pass a federal spending bill. Negotiations stalled over President Donald Trump's demand for money to build a U.S.-Mexico border wall. Congressional leaders and the White House have pledged to keep talking through the weekend in search of a deal. The shutdown is the third this year. More than 400,000 federal employees who are deemed essential will continue to work without pay during the holiday period, while another 380,000 will be Put on temporary leave. The U.S. Special Envoy in the fight against the Islamic State group has quit over President Donald Trump's decision to pull troops out of Syria. A State Department official says Brett McGurk had planned to leave his role next year but brought his departure forward. Mr. McGurk's departure follows the sudden resignation of Defense Secretary James Mattis, who had also opposed withdrawing troops from Syria and reducing the U.S. presence in Afghanistan. And you're watching Channel News Asia.